from Los Angeles, the 22nd Annual American Film Institute Life Achievement Award. A salute to Jack Nicholson. Tonight, the American Film Institute invites you to join leaders in the motion picture and television community as they gather at the Beverly Hilton in Los Angeles to pay tribute to one of its brightest stars, an actor whose life in film spans four decades. Ladies and gentlemen, Warren Beatty. Thank you. Thank you. For the benefit of the American Film Institute, uh, it's a great pleasure for me to be able to come here tonight and to uh, pay honor to the films of uh, and the lifetime achievement of uh, Jack Nicholson. You know, when he, he expressed to me uh, some slight amount of uneasiness on the uh, area of, uh, you know, the lifetime aspect of it, I, I, uh, I, I, um, I really, uh, I think that I uh, handled it in the right way because actually most of the people that have uh, gotten this thing have been in considerably advanced years. Uh, and, uh, but I, I think you'd all agree with me that I did the right thing when I said, look, uh, after all, um, for instance, uh, you know, when I was a, a kid in grade school in Virginia, uh, 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 you were the leading man in the movies that all the kids in my class wanted to see. And I, I, just, I just think it's very exciting for those of our generation to come and pay respect to an actor of your generation. So I, I, I just... Uh, right, right, right. Uh, I, 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 I think what I'll just do is say a few things about him uh, that you probably uh, know. For instance, um, I have found that he will go to great lengths to be in a good mood. <laughs> Far greater than I will. Um, Jack is a closet exerciser. Closet exerciser. You'd be surprised. He's in pretty good shape. And I want you to listen to one thing, please. He is every bit as vain as I am. <laughs> he is honest. He is empathetic. He is discreet. He is trustworthy. He continues to cultivate the art of friendship and the art of living with the same grace and avidity as he does the art of acting, and I don't know any artist in those three fields that I value more. I can assure you... I can assure you of one thing. He may not be at the beginning of his career, but he is definitely just getting into the middle. <laughs> 